Hi, my name is Britt Spears. I'm a certified prosthetist orthodist and a fellow of the American Academy of Orthodists and Prosthetists. Today we're going to discuss phantom pain and phantom sensation. Phantom pain is common, especially in the early stages of amputation. Generally, whenever the perineal nerve is cut on a below knee amputee, there is pressure being applied by edema during the early stages. Edema is swelling. The edema is putting pressure on the perineal nerve and is sending signals to the brain, and your brain is correlating that with pain in an area that you no longer have, such as a toe or a heel or the whole foot. Um, as far as phantom sensation, phantom sensation is possibly an itch or having pressure of feeling in the area where the foot or toe has been. Um, this is something that will always be with you from time to time. Phantom pain, the earlier that compression therapy is applied to the residual limb, the quicker the phantom pain tends to go away. Very few patients end up with permanent phantom pain. The earlier that, that the residual limb is being treated with compression, the quicker that that should go away. Generally, at the longest, in most cases, phantom pain will be there for the first year. Um, now, people that are born without limbs um, that have areas of their body missing never experience phantom pain or sensation because the brain is not wired that way. Thank you. We'll discuss further.